Now let's talk about risks and benefits. This operation is not completely risk-free. And in fact, in 90% of the um, patients who undergo deep brain stimulation, they don't have many problems. And if I told you, if I said, let's go to the casino, and you pull that slot machine, and, and what's going to happen is you're going to win 90% of the time, you're going to pull that arm. But it's very important for you to understand that there are complications and there are risks. Whenever we pass these little microelectrodes and these little DBS leads into the brain, we can collide with blood vessels or we can damage uh, some of the brain structures and you can get things like strokes or bleeds and you can, certain side effects can happen in patients like weakness or numbness or changes in vision and changes in speech. Even though those are um, a very small percentage of patients, it, it's important for you to understand that the operation has risks and if you end up with a side effect, you get 100% of that side effect. And so it's important to understand that it's not risk-free. The devices don't have blood supplies. And why is that important? Well, if you get a little fleck of something onto that device, what can happen is it can get infected. And without a blood supply, we can't give you an antibiotic that penetrates that device by being delivered through the blood to treat it. And so what happens when we see infections, which can happen in 5% or more of the cases, sometimes we have to take the hardware out, treat the infection, and then reimplant it. And so infection is a very real risk. We also worry about worsening thinking, worsening the cognitive function of patients. And if you have any pre-existing depression or anxiety, we want to make sure that's treated and stable because we don't want to make you worse with the operation. It's important to realize that these are hardware um, parts just like you might get in Home Depot so they can break so you may need to get a wire replaced or a box replaced at, at some point uh, during the, uh, the course of your therapy and so it's important to have regular follow-up visits with your doctors. The risk-benefit ratio in well-selected patients is very good but it's important to always remember that this isn't a risk-free operation.